That belongs in a museum. Later on in the game. Yeah, it's for sure an additional concern in this slower build of the Druid, though. Normally when you're playing the fast, aggressive Druid, you don't really care about healing after Alexstrasza because your goal is to put so much pressure on that they can never activate that offensive Alexstrasza into two-turn kill. Uh, but in this deck, you know, probably going to be drawn out a bit longer, so you may have to defend against an Alexstrasza at some point. But I totally agree with the poor hand that he had. Pulling for resources there with the lore is, makes a lot of sense. I think Game Hunter, not going to be bad. Uh, useful against the Alex Straza, but likely not going to get any damage to face. So it's nice to have maybe a little bit preemptive right now, a little bit too soon, but uh, still still not bad overall. Yeah, I think Ancient of War still has a lot of merit onto the board. I think you're slightly afraid of the follow-up on Seven because he did Blizzard. Blizzard into Flame Strike is a really common setup. But that would still mean the Ancient of War is safe, as long as you root it. I mean, there <laughs> is this possibility. Oh, Root! Wow! Bill this guy is a badass! A huge chance right here! What? Wow! Bill, that, Bill. A, that was a play for his family. Yeah, I was gonna say, <laughs> Bill is making the plays here. Maybe not to win the game, but to win the hearts of Twitch chat. And we all know yeah. that's what matters. Bill knows he's behind in the polls and he wants to bring those numbers up. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> no, but it, it's a calculated risk. Bill knows that Chess Dude might have fight or might have Flame Strike, but he doesn't have yeah. enough mana, even with coin, to use Flame Strike and a ping. So. This oh, Ancient man. of War will likely live. It was a calculated risk again. The Blizzard, unfortunately, going to shut it down. Bill. Chest dude healing for 10 health off those zombie chows, but what a chance. Oh, Bill, what have you done? You've broken Frodan. He's just over there in the corner. They'll <laughs> <laughs> play the Ice Barrier. Ice barrier yeah. Right, yeah, I believe so. The 10 1 comes off the board. There would be 6 8 in play, plus 14. So 22, 28. So, yeah, he's at 30. It'd be 28 damage. So, yeah, get Enough. the value out of the Ice Barrier while you can. Harrison Jones not handy in this matchup. Uh, Bill looking for that last bit of damage to close out this game. Shredder's really nice, but he's also now have to, he has to kill this Emperor Tharason. It's so dangerous to leave it up on the board, but if he does that, he's sacrificing the damage that he does have to potentially win this game. Oh, not Captain's a good outcome. Captain's Parrot. You know, Harrison Jones is still not too bad. It's a five tag minion, so it's still right. extremely relevant. And your opponent didn't flame strike last turn, which was probably a board you would have gone for. Mm -hmm. So I still think Harrison is not the worst outcome. Although, you know, you're not exactly happy it's that it's not Ancient of Lore number two, for example. Sure. Yeah, obviously you're very at risk whenever Chess Dude does draw uh, that flame strike. Even, you know, Frost Nova would be pretty mm. good here. He's used both Blizzards, so that's not going to be an opt. Mid-range double combo Druid, just so hard to do better than. Well, never say never. I mean, one of these things is Bill also might pick up a way to heal with Ancient of Lore, and then Freeze Mage doesn't have damage to finish. Uh, it's not out of the realm of possibility that Bill Bill still wins this game, although I'm just giving a, a pretty significant advantage to Chess Dude. Ice Lance drawn here. The Frostbolt was used in the previous turn with the Antonidas, so he's short and active as a Freeze Mage. Sure. If Lotheb is played, then you want to play Pyroblast first so you can still Fireball, but then... You can't fit the ping in as well the as the Fireball, in. yeah. Yeah, I suppose so. But he's, he, I think, all things considered, this has to be the line. Two cards in hand. You don't have to play around much when there's two cards in hand. The odds are very heavily in your favor. They're not going to have any particular outcome. Out on me. So assuming this is Bill's withdraw, Chess Dude will win. He's even considering holding on or using the Ice Lance. And that Savage Roar is too late. Roar. Oh. It won't do anything. Yep, no outs here for Bill. He's just not going to be able to find a way to solve this. And Chess Dude has navigated a game of Freeze Mage against Druid without ever having a secret in play outside of that Ice Barrier. Fantastic series. Chess Dude stays alive, sending home Bill to his family, saying better luck next season. For now, the 17-year-old Phenom continues his run in the America's Championship. I'm so impressed. So impressed with Me Chess too. Dude. I